What is going on guys? It's your boy Validate Howie here with Tim Welcome Back to another Infinite Wolf commentary here today. So in this gameplay you are going to witness I'm playing Team Deathmatch on Precinct. Um so pretty much what happens in this whole gameplay I I was just playing really really carefully and really I wasn't really rushing that much, like I don't know why, like I think because I haven't played this game for like two or three days so I'm just taking it slowly. And you can see here, so you can see here I'm just taking my time going around the corners and being really careful where enemies are. A little, little did, I, did I know that the all of the guys on the other team had very very bad KDs so I should have actually been able to get the atomizer easily. but. I was in the case, so obviously it's a full game. As I see there, my aim was off quite a bit because I wasn't using, um, I believe I didn't have rifle barrel on this class. So obviously in long range, shooting was going to be a little bit inaccurate. So you can see here, I sit in the back of the map and I pull up my scab, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, I do. I pull up my scab, so pretty much. The main reason why I missed out on my nuke because I was one kill off and I got the final kill at the end of the game. So I used my scalp to get two kills. If I didn't do that, if I used my gun, I would have been able to call my Diadomizer in, but I wouldn't have obviously gotten any kills with the Diadomizer because I would have caught, in, caught it in at the very end of the game. So it would have been almost extremely pointless on calling it in. But anyway, so. Um, like I was surprised because my aim wasn't really that good this game, so I was really surprised when I was went on the 26, 26 kill streak. So I got, I think, I think I got 20, I got 25, 24 kills with the uh, with the uh, K bar, and then I got 20, and I got two kills with the scout. That's right. Yeah. So that's after the 26. So. Because there were only four guys on the other team, it made it a lot harder. And also the fact that I was running the completely wrong score streaks. If I was running UAV, county UAV, and advanced UAV, I would have had a much higher chance of getting a nuke because I would have been able to find where he was. But because I was using Scarab for the first score streak, I was kind of dumb because I thought to take it off from doing one of the old old contracts that I had to do for um. Saber Team 7, so to get 10 kills with ground score streaks, I have to use the scab obviously. So, um, yeah, so I was very, obviously you'll, you'll hear my reaction at the end of the game, I was very annoyed when I realised that I choked the atomizer, I could have had it. I should have just rushed, rushed the guys a lot more because they wouldn't have, wouldn't have been able to stand a chance against me, but I've made that mistake, I've definitely learned from it. You know, when you're playing against guys who are you know, complete noobs, just go for it. Just don't walk, just don't play it slowly, just rush like crazy because you know half the time these guys these guys reaction times won't be won't be that great. So um, you can see obviously they're in the scorecard there quickly, you know. None of them are going terribly, terribly well. So there's me and my other team are coming first. We were, we were pretty much doing all the work. Um, apart from the guy in, I think, third place, he was going quite well as well. As you can see here, so I just sit back a bit. Obviously, I jumped back there because the grenade was going to come and I wasn't going to you know, stay there. You can see here, I go around in the back through the drop pods and I go up, I go through the alley. I go through the alley. And then you can see I work my way around the map. So I'm going 13 and 0 at this point. I go back on here. I believe two teammates sitting and a guy. I don't know how I missed him. I got him. That's 14 and 0. And then I somehow got that guy. I got 15 to Ruthless. This is where I call him a scarab again. I'm pretty sure it's around here. Yeah, it's here. So you can see here, I pull it out. Don't know why I bought it, but got that guy. You can see that obviously I got it affected by the blast, so I. My movement got slowed down a bit. So I can see here, I could have rushed those guys if I wanted to, but I didn't because I thought, you know what? What if I miss some sorts? Like, what if I get sniped? Then there's my stay gone. So I didn't. I decided to go back around the other way. So I went back, 
back around alley. I went through the charging station or whatever it's called, and an alley, and then back to the drop pods. And then I followed my teammate. I didn't go through mid because that's the worst thing you can do. I'm back back through tops. And see I go through go past statue and I'm in, in the lobby. See I'm just chilling, just seeing where they're at. See I get this guy here. At 16 and 0. So you can see that I'm 10 kills off my nuke. 17. But at this point my heart was racing because I was getting quite close. I was getting kind of nervous, so like I didn't want to do anything stupid. I was like freaking out, like, okay, this is it, this is my chance. You can see here, like that aim there is just terrible. Like I don't know why I even bothered going for that shot. I knew that I was gonna miss it. It's extremely shaky. So, so I go back to that dude. That guy that I'd seen the corner, like I was gonna get him because I could see him. It's too easy, and I got this guy here, so. I, 120 guns, like, I was extremely nervous, see, my hands were sweating. And my heart was just racing like crazy, because I was literally... So close to getting my first Datomizer in this game. I would have had a lot more nukes if I hadn't choked them. It was bad luck and... Other things, I can see, so I get counter UAV assist. See that I'm watching the middle of the map again, so you can see, I just... I just Stay in lobby for the rest of the game, I think. See the grenade there. Get that guy, some five kills off. I see him taking to six. Like, I don't know why I want to slow that. I should have just flanked them because I would have easily gotten my nuke. So I could have got an easy four kills here. And I would have been able to call my datamizer on in the game. And I would have had at least probably maybe. 30 something, 30 something kills to, 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 to zero, but I didn't, because I wasn't thinking. I was feeling the pressure of getting him a nuke, and I just wasn't thinking straight. And yeah, so you can see I'm four kills off here. See, so I pretty much just, just waste the opportunity. Like, I got the final kill at the end of the game, and I realized. Hang on, I could have gotten a got an AD atomizer then. And see here, so I rewind out of here because I realized my salt was gonna go off. Get that guy, three kills off. Just miss that shot. Get the sniper. I'm two two kills off, so I'm on my, my brutal. I can see I, I go around here. So no, yeah, I go back to mid. Yeah, I go to mid. I left the lobby again. So here I get the very last kill here. So I was extremely annoyed when I realized I got the last kill. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay. If you did, please smash that like button and comment on, down man. below what you thought of the gameplay. It's always a bit boring. Oh, the best okay, and if you're new to the channel, subscribe as well. Anyway, it's just going to be boring. Hell ah. out. Peace out, guys. Proper good job. Well done. I'm annoyed.